Moose has good crunch. Has what? Good crunch on the crust. Good crunch on the crust. What is up guys? We're here to settle the debate on who has the best pizza. And we're gonna do that the only way we know how in the month of March, and that's with a bracket challenge. Let's pick up the pizzas. Alright guys, so now it's time for the blind taste test. Gun, are you ready? Yes. Do you know your pizzas really well? Yes. Do you know which one you think is gonna win? No. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so in this tournament we're gonna be doing two rounds. The first round is cheese pizza. If they make it to the final round, we will then be comparing a pepperoni pizza. Now we're gonna be doing our first matchup. The number one pizza versus the number four pizza. Let's get it started. All right, Glenn, you ready? Yep. Okay, here's the number one seed. Well, I can tell by the crust if I touch it. What? No way. 100%. Here you go. <laughs> Come yeah, on, give me the pizza. Come on. <laughs> number one seed? Yeah. What does it feel like? Feels like a pizza, dog. <laughs> all right, oh, maybe we should get like a half crust. Half no, no, you should do the first all yeah, thing and then bite. the favorite bite. What are you thinking? It's good. I don't know if I really like the crust texture. What's wrong with the crust? This one feels a little doughy right now. But the cheese is good. Sure. You like the cheese? I definitely like the cheese. Okay, half crust, half pizza. Mm. What are your thoughts? The sauce is good. You like the sauce? Yeah. So sauce, cheese, and crust, those are the three factors, I guess. Give me the next seat. Okay, this is the number four seat. Here you go. Oh, I know this one for sure. You know this one for sure? Yeah. Through and through, you know? This one's definitely more oily. How's the cheese? Ooh, the cheese is good. And the sauce. There you go. It's good? All right, you gotta go for the crust bite. Dang, how's the crust? It's good. I don't know, it's not as doughy. It's soft? Is it is soft, though. It's on the softer side? But it doesn't taste doughy. There's a lot of cheese on this one compared to the other one. All right, Glenn, who wins? The number one seed or the number four seed? I think right now, we have a sleeper, and it goes upset, number four. Woo! All right, the number four seed is moving on. Let's get the next matchup going. Now for our next matchup. The number two pizza versus the number three pizza. Let's get it going. All right, Glenn, you ready? Yes. Okay, here is the number two seed. Right here. Come on, come on. Ooh, I like this one. Ooh, what do you like about it? What do you smell? It smells like cheese. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> Ooh, that was a champion bite right there. What do you think about it? Let's go. How is the crust? The crust texture is good because it has a little bit of crunchiness unlike the other ones did. Oh yeah. I don't know if I like the cheese on this. Why? I don't know. It's not as cheesy, like it doesn't have a cheese pull at all. It's super light on the sauce. So what's your overall thoughts on that slice? It's okay. All right, we got to the number three seed. You ready? Yep. Okay. <laughs> it smells normal. Okay. <laughs> you imply ability? <laughs> what are you thinking? Cheese is the same as the last one. The sauce is way better. I already tasted it. You can barely taste it on the last one? Yeah. All right, Glenn. This is the first one I tried? This one. And then what number seed is this? This is the number two seed. I'm gonna have to go seed number two. Woo! Number two is moving on to the final round. So we have a number two versus four matchup. All right, guys, we have come to the final round. Now we're comparing pepperoni pizzas. Here we have the number two seed versus the number four seed. What are your thoughts on the first couple of pizzas? Not enough flavor. I never get cheese pizza. But could you, you could clearly taste which one is better. They all had different attributes that were better in one and then the other. But I guess just enjoyability overall is what I went for. All right, we're gonna start with the number four. The yeah. underdog. Here you go. This one tastes a little bit more spongy. Can I just get a pepperoni, is it? Yep. I have a little bit of spice on the pepperoni. I don't really like the. It's really squishy. Yeah. Good cheese flavor that I had the first round. The sauce is good, you know, average, nothing special. Mm -hmm. Like the, the number three seed or whatever, that had good sauce. Okay. I like this one a lot. You do? I think the cheese is a big part of it. Okay. Oh, okay. Now, number two seed. Good crunch on the crust. Good crunch on the crust. How's the pepperoni? This one's good. <laughs> it's good? Did you do a crust cheese bite? Pepperoni's good. <laughs> the sauce isn't that good though. I prefer the cheese on the other one, but mm -hmm. this one has a better crust you know, and pepperoni. This pepperoni oh, like, it's like a little crispy. <laughs> Have you, uh... Okay, Gunnar's gonna take a little moment to do his final deliberation, and we'll get right back with you with the final results. All right, Glenn, it's time for your final choice. Your number two seed is on your left hand, right here. Your number four seed is on your right hand. Give me your final thoughts and pick your winner. My final thoughts. 
every pizza had their own strong points. If I could make a perfect pizza, it'd have the sauce of number three, the crust of number two, the cheese of number four, but the pepperoni was good on, on number two. But going off overall of what I tried today, I think I'm gonna have to pick pizza number two. Woo! And you wanna know what it is? Domino's. Domino's, baby! Earlier in the car we had a conversation and we said that Domino's is the best. And Glenn said he stood by Pizza Hut. And I guess it just goes to show Domino's has the best pizza. <laughs> Why are you mad, Glenn? It's good pizza. Alright guys, we want to thank you for watching our bracket challenge. Please stay tuned for the rest of this month for March Madness to see more of our bracket challenges. For any of you new viewers, if you guys could please hit that subscribe button. And if you already subscribed, please hit that bell button below to receive all our notifications and we just thank you guys for watching and we'll catch you guys next time on Hype Foods.